Hi, I'm Dan, and this is my wife, Bree, along with our two dogs, Penny and Bella. For the last 12 years, we have traveled the west coast of the USA and the north and the south islands of New Zealand. We have found ourselves after 19 moves here in South Lake Tahoe, where we have bought a home, and we feel very fortunate to be here. Please come along and enjoy our adventures. Welcome to Tahoe Mountain Life. So with regard to the beach cleanup at Kiva, meeting there at 2, the gate should still be closed and so we'll be walking in with some trash bags that we'll hand out to people. Um, yeah, and it's about, I want to say about a half mile walk on a road because all the snow will be gone at this point um, to get to Kiva Beach. And then yeah, I figure we'll spend time for half an hour, hour, whatever it takes, if there is anything at all to clean up. If there's nothing to actually clean up, we'll just hang out at the beach. So for those of you who aren't as familiar with where this is located, uh, here I have a map pulled up. Uh, we have obviously the kind of the casinos and the gondola for Heavenly. And then we have the Y here between 50 and 89. And where we're planning to meet is a place called Kiva Beach. Okay, so here I have magnified the map a little bit. So as you're coming down 89, the first beach you come to is Pope Beach. And then you kind of come more closer towards Valhalla, the Talak historic site. And then essentially, this is there'll be a gate that will still be up right here. And this is, this is where we're going to meet right here at 2 p.m. Uh, this is the road we'll walk in. And Kiva Beach is essentially this section here. And it comes right up to the, the point of where uh, the creek comes into... Lake Tahoe as the rest of this becomes Baldwin Beach and that is uh, not a dog friendly area but yeah so we are going to bring our two dogs they'll be with us um, and so if you have dogs feel free to bring them as well. Oh this is awesome! Well good morning guys I did not expect to find myself on the bike but we didn't get any snow overnight, so took advantage of that. It's a little chilly, but the sun is out. So we're gonna go for a bike ride, and then we have uh, just a couple of announcements that we wanted to try to set some dates for a beach cleanup, and then also a local meetup just at one of the local restaurants. So we'll get to that later in the video. Definitely not in biking shape. We'll get there though. Oh man, blue skies. It is a little chillier, but that's nice on the uphill. It's just a beautiful ride. All right, we're almost up to the saddle. All right, this looks like the end of the road. Almost to the summit, probably about 100, 150 vertical feet short. One other thing that happened at the end of last season was that my rear shock was basically every ride losing 50 to 75 PSI. And so I just limped through and pumped it back up when needed, but got it sent into the shop and basically I had a bunch of seals that were blown. So this is a rebuilt shock in the rear. So I'm curious to see how it does on the way down. All right, so we're about to ready to head down. have a down tree. Yeah, so anyway, one of the things we were hoping to do was a beach cleanup at Kiva next Saturday at 2 p.m. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. Shock feels really nice. <laughs> yeah. 
even more work. What a crew. More trees down. Okay. Beware. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? Great. Enjoy. Day. Yes, it is. Hi, Pop. Yeah, it's definitely not fully clear of snow at this point, but man, some people have done an amazing amount of work to shovel out some of those corners. Well, that's a wrap, guys. We hope to see you all out there when we go for our beach cleanup.